What's up guys? Graham here. Alright, I'm kind of dabbling into a world that I'm not really used to, so if I do really bad during this warfront, I apologize. But I'm running Melee Rogue, which I've pretty much not run since I first hit level 60. Uh, I ran it some whenever I was leveling up, and then once I hit level 60, I ran it a little bit more, but I did really bad with it. And I think it was all because, well, I know I know I was playing it wrong, but also I think it was a gear issue as well because I was playing a, a squishy spec, and then I was having to be in the damage, and then my gear was really bad, so it was just a recipe for disaster. Uh, Trunks here. Yeah, died, Trunks. That's a good player there. But, um, yeah, I, I knew I was playing it wrong and stuff, so whenever people start recommending that I need to play Assassin Rogue lately, I said, okay, well, let's learn it. So, what's the, what's the first thing I'm going to do to learn the spec? I'm going to hit up some of the best rogues that I know, which is Viral, Ekru, people like that. So, I started sending those guys tells, and, you know, I was like, Teach me, man, because I'm not playing it right. I need to learn to play it right, and then I can, you know, apply all of my other PvP skills to it and hopefully be a very devastating uh, assassin rogue. And they, they told me all the stuff to do and, you know, a lot of the stuff not to do, and Ekru was, man, just so helpful. Can't thank the guy enough. He was awesome. He, he talked with me quite a bit before he got he had to go raid so man okay trunks i am not falling for that dude look at him he's dotting me up and running away i'm not gonna get kited what do you think i am man what do you think i am i'm not your run in the mill newbie all right but so, one of the first things they told me is never, ever, ever macro poison malice. Don't do it. Of course, uh, whenever I'm trying to learn this spec, what's the first thing I do? I throw poison malice into a macro. <laughs> so, don't read me too much, guys. I know it's wrong. I know I shouldn't be doing it, but I'm trying to learn the spec. So, hopefully I can provide uh, good warfronts for you guys in the future, playing Assassin. Of course, with that not in my macros, but I'm trying to learn it right now. And hopefully do some build videos in the future and stuff after I've got it down. So, hmm, man, I'm taking so much damage. See, one of the specs that Ekru gave me was a good uh, assassin, marksman, uh, rift, rift stalker build, I believe it was. Well, uh, I, of course, right off the bat said, man, hopefully I'll have a healer, so I want to go full DPS. What's a good spec to run for full DPS? So he gave me a Nightblade variation of Assassin. Uh, look at you up there. I'm coming to kill you. Oh, it's a rogue. No, he went into stealth and dropped the stone. So he's going to open up on me here. This is going to be a losing fight. Alright, let's see how much damage I can do to him. Alright, stunned him. Got bleeds up. I'm gonna lose that fight. Alright, let's see if I can get up there and stab him. If I can open up on him, he's gonna die. Oh, look at him. He's drinking the best drink that you can have that makes you heal up the fastest. And I couldn't get up the hill. Oh man, that was a bad scenario. But that that's a classic example of what I was just about to say. Is that uh, the spec that I ended up get, uh, running that Ekru said that I could run. Not the one he recommended. The one he said I could run. Uh, was more of a DPS variation but much more squishy. And now what I'm running into is that if anybody gets to open up on me or anything like that, or if I have to go much into 
enemy fire, I'm just taking too much damage. Gosh, this is looking bad. Oh, okay. I was about to say they had two two stones capped on us and a third one on the way, but our guys just uh, robbed to them. Oh, I've got to get out of there. That was a lot of people, and I am not on my warrior. On my warrior, I'll charge right in there because I, I know exactly what I can handle on my warrior. I know I can probably kill all three of those guys, or it might have been even more. But even if I get in trouble, I know I can probably get away. Not so on my rogue. I, I know I can slip away, but, you know, I don't have much of a chance of killing all three of them, I don't think. Not, not at my skill level yet. I've got to learn this spec a little bit more before I start doing crazy stuff like, Oh, that's that rogue. I'm going to open up on you now. What do you think about that? <laughs> uh, I'm going to make sure you die, man. I'm going to make sure. Poof. Nope. You should have had the macro say, Ugh, because that's what you did. Uh, Trunks here. Have a nice dirt nap, Trunks. Very good. Oh, it's over. No, we lost. Well, I went 10-0, you know, came into it a little bit late, but Trunks beat me out on kills, but he also died twice. I think I killed him both the times, didn't I? But, oh well. It's a good initial run for me running Assassin. Hopefully I make more videos on it. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And as usual, my name is Grim, and I will see you next time.